We're gonna get through this. I promise. Now go get some rest. Do you need help? Wish I could say we've been through worse. But I doubt any salvager has had this much bad luck on a single expedition. Salvagers. You part of Karif's crew? Yes. Didn't think we were that well known. So you came here to make some armor. It doesn't look like things went according to plan. <laughs> you could say that again. I thought I had it made when we found some prime rollerback salvage out here. Then came the sandstorm. Blew away most of our gear and ran us right into a camp full of angry Tanakh. We fled, but by the time the storm died down, we found ourselves here with half our food gone. Open to attack by machines and Tanakh alike. Sounds like you could use a hand. I'm Aloy. Runda. I can't ask you to help for free. How about I hire you to get us what we need? Draw up some contracts. Uh, you don't have to wouldn't be a proper salvager if i didn't won't take no for an answer you mentioned this place is exposed to attack is there anything you can use to set up a perimeter we know there's a bellow back hanging around some ruins near here take it down without damaging its cargo sacks and we could use it to make new traps Set up a cordon. I'll make it a contract. Sounds like a plan. You mentioned your people needed food. We lost most of it when we ran away from the Tanakh. But only a bristleback would be able to sniff it out underneath all that sand. That's not a bad idea. I'll look into it. That's good to hear. You said you lost your gear? Yes. Can't be sure where it is, since that storm gave us the runaround. But I have a general idea. It's all in the contract. If you can get that gear back, we'd at least be able to set up camp properly. Make the crew comfortable. I'll take a look as soon as I can. I have to get going. Good luck to us both. Never see it to knock again. I'll count All right. Lucky. Cool. We'll think about that. I see you, champion. Sit, please. Be careful if you're traveling southwest, champion. Rebels have set up camp in the hills. I'm sure they'd be more than happy to dig your grave. Thanks for the warning. Sounds like the Tanoth could use a hand dealing with these rebels. You shouldn't miss this chance to trade. Sea of Sands completed. Now let's go to Gaia. He's like uh, Gaia's own personal blacksmith. Yeah, a very angry. Welcome back, Aloy. I see you have recovered Poseidon. Yes, I have. And here you go. You want to talk? Hello, Aloy. So, I guess Beta's here to stay. I gave her a focus. Told her to talk to you to see if she can help. She's... 
Not what I expected. What were you expecting? I don't know. Someone more helpful, I guess. And less pessimistic. It is true she overestimated our progress. However, it is also worth noting that her confidence in your abilities emboldened her to escape the Zeniths. I guess so. Give her time. She may yet come around. How's Catalo doing? I have detected that the loss of his arm still deeply pains him. In an effort to remedy this, I have discussed a potential solution with him. I believe he will want to fill you in on the details. A solution? I'll check in with him when I can, then. What is the state of the biosphere? Is the terraforming system functioning at all? In a sense, the terraforming system never stopped functioning. The difference, since my predecessor's destruction, is that there has been no central governing intelligence to monitor its robotic agents and assign new tasks. As a result, errors have accrued, and day by day, the biosphere has gradually veered ever more sharply towards destruction. In recent months, disturbances in the biosphere have become obvious. But these bellwether phenomena offer just the merest glimpse of the complex and accelerating cycles of environmental dysfunction, now driving Earth's biosphere towards collapse. Then you can't do anything to stop it. If you can return Aether, Poseidon, and Demeter to me, I can improvise modest corrections to parts of the system. Weather will improve, water will be purified, and rampant plant growth curtailed. But such corrections will not stave off collapse. They will only buy us time. Only with Hephaestus can I design and produce new robotic agents designed to permanently reverse the damage that has accumulated. All efforts must be directed toward that end. How long do we have, then? At present rates, without additional factors. The biosphere will cross a point of no return in approximately four months. And if I gather Aether, Demeter, Poseidon, merge you with them? We will only gain a few months more. Well, every bit counts. How are things around here? Zoe has been studying the morphology of her land gods in an effort to understand their sickness. Without the abilities of Hephaestus, I am unfortunately unable to correct their programming. However, due to Zoe's perseverance, we may have a workaround. Yeah, she filled me in. Sounds promising. Varl and Zoe seem to like spending time together. Indeed. While studying old world data, Zoe discovered references to a dietary lifestyle known as vegetarianism. She appreciated the similarities with Utaru practices and encouraged Varl to try out this lifestyle. And how did that go? I believe they have agreed to disagree. How's Erend handling things? He is becoming increasingly accustomed to use of the focus. After an initial incident. What did he do? He unfortunately crushed his first focus as he attempted to affix it to his temple. Amongst a number of Osaram curses, I believe he also blamed the focus for being... Dainty. He has given repeated assurances that it will not happen again. Well, good thing we have a lot of extras, I guess. So there's a few people here now, and they're... learning. All about you, the ancient world. Almost like what was supposed to happen before Apollo was purged. Yes. While the loss of the Apollo database was catastrophic, 
There is still much that can be gleaned from the data you have uncovered. For instance, Varl has been reviewing the last recorded entries from those who perished during the Pharaoh Plague. Hearing their hopes and fears made him quite somber. Anything I should be worried about? I do not believe so. I have elected not to intervene, to allow him to process this on his own terms. So the Hades Proving Lab, where I found the Gaia Colonel, it used to be a Pharaoh research facility? Yes. Prior to appropriation by Zero Dawn, the facility was used to engineer and test advanced computer viruses. It appears to have been one of many research initiatives by Pharaoh Automated Solutions. I guess it wasn't enough to build automated killing machines. He wanted viruses to infect them with too. So, a while back, before the battle at Meridian, I went into Banuk territory. I discovered another AI there, one not related to Zero Dawn, Cyan. It was created to oversee operations for a volcanic stabilization project, and it spent the last thousand years in isolation. I'm guessing you didn't know about it? No. From the data on your focus, it seems that Cyan was cut off from the outside world. An effort by its creators to protect it from the Pharaoh Plague. Any chance it could help us now? I have already attempted contact, with no success. Given its previous experience with accepting an outside network request, I imagine it is unwilling to do so again. Right. Because last time Hephaestus enslaved it. Well, that's too bad. I think the two of you would have had a lot to talk about. The processor Ether was installed on was part of an ancient war museum. A memorial to something called the Hot Zone Crisis. Do you know anything about it? My knowledge of historical events was unfortunately lost with the Apollo database. However, climate data indicates a peak in regional temperatures in the 2030s. Such conditions would see extreme prolonged droughts, an increase in dust storms, and a loss of habitable landmass. But they wouldn't have built a museum in the middle of a wasteland. So I guess things got better eventually. Yes. Data suggests that temperatures return to average levels in the clawback era of the 2040s. This game has a lot of information. I'm not going to ask all the questions, but I will get some from Tom and Tom. I'll be on my way. I wish you safe travels. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac! Daddy sure does love his little big man. She found that recording from the data on your focus. She's been watching it a lot. I think it helps calm her. You know, I used to watch this a lot too. Whenever I wanted to take my mind off things. Daddy sure does love his little big... But there's something you need to tell me? While you were gone, I came down here to check on her. Then we started talking. Right, Beta? She's been thinking about how to capture Hephaestus, studying the data Gaia gave her. But we started talking about some other stuff. You know, just getting to know each other, right? And then she told me that one of the Zeniths might be different from the others. Tilda. You saw her at the Hades Proving Lab. Go on. On the way to Earth, the Zeniths never showed their faces. My servitor caretaker referred to them as my benefactors and promised I'd meet them someday when I had learned enough. And then, one day, a data channel opened in my training interface. In it, 
Tilda was waiting for me. In a virtual replica of a house on a cliff overlooking the ocean. It was beautiful. She showed me paintings, books, media files. We'd met there in secret many times. But a few months later, it stopped. Can you tell us why, Beta? I found some data about Tilda at the Hades Proving Lab. I think she was a liaison between Far Zenith and Zero Dawn. She knew Elizabeth Sobek, that's for sure. Maybe that's why she reached out to you? What else can you tell us about Tilda? She... liked to talk about her paintings. What about herself? Did she ever talk about her life on Earth? How she joined the Zeniths? Something like that? She never said much about herself, and she hated it when I asked too many questions. But I think, back on Earth, she was an expert programmer, given that she built a data channel the other Zeniths couldn't detect. Is there anything else about her that we might be able to use to our advantage? She was the first real person who ever bothered to speak to me. I wasn't really assessing her for strengths and weaknesses. Hmm. So Tilda set up a secret virtual space where she could talk to you, a house on a cliff. Then later, she cut you off. But other than the fact that Tilda knew Elizabeth, you don't know why she did those things? I don't, okay? I thought of every possible reason that would make her leave, but whatever I did wrong, I don't know what it is. When I finally met the others, she ignored me. I acted like the data channel never existed. None of this even matters. Tilda's the same as the others. It won't help us defeat them. Okay. Let's leave it at that, then. What's wrong? I'm trying, Varl. But she is tough to take. I'm out there in the wilds, risking my life every day, and all she can do is hide in there and tell us how hopeless it all is. I'm sorry, she's had a rough time, but she is really not helping right now. Hmm. You always seem to be on top of everything, so I sometimes forget about what you've been through. I mean... It wasn't that long ago you were so banged up you couldn't even walk. About that. When I pulled you out of the water back near the Proving Lab, you were muttering Rost's name. You never talk about him. But he raised you. Trained you. You must miss him a lot. Of course I do. But I don't have time to think about that now. I need to get back out there. Okay. I'll keep working with Beta. Gaia says she knows a lot about Zero Dawn. And maybe she just needs some time to adjust, and then she can help us with Hephaestus. Sure. But I won't hold my breath. Yeah, Varl will do that for you. It's just go to what level is that? Oh, it's not that bad. It's a, I'm a higher, way higher. I don't think that door had power before, but looks like it's malfunctioning. Looks like some kind of maintenance space. Maintenance, but secret compartment kind of thing. Yeah, I went the wrong way, but it's okay. Power cells? Huh. 
arrow cells, but for what? Seemed like you and Varl were down in that basement for a while. Yeah, everything's fine, I guess. Well, okay. Uh, what, what can I do for you? Let's play strike. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what are you working on with your focus? I'm still figuring out how to read stuff on this thing. Those two lovebirds over there have been giving me a hand. But to be honest, all the little symbols, they give me a headache. But I'll get up to speed. I promise. Did you speak with Beta at all? She didn't really wake up till we brought her here. And when she did, I, I thought it'd be better if Zoe and Varl took care of her. No use crowding someone when they're in a state. So, you've met our new Tanakh friend. He's, uh, quiet. I thought his people were supposed to be bloodthirsty maniacs. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. Yeah. Well, I guess if you trust him, so do I. So, you've been sifting through loads of data? Yeah, it's interesting. There's lots of words. I, I thought maybe I could try finding things with more, you know, pictures in it. Not much luck there, but I, I did find out about these, uh, Holofilms? Like images put together to tell a story. Now, they were made to look like they were the real thing. You know, the Osaram like shows. I bet they pay a lot of shards for those hollows. It seems like you're getting a hang of this data thing. Yeah, it's been helpful. When I could make sense of anything. I did find the old ones enjoyed a good brew like the rest of us. Only they let machines serve the stuff. In bars. They even let the damn things cut you off before you saw the underside of a table. Uh, and that's half the fun. Now, you won't see me letting a robot serve me a pitcher anytime soon. What are you reading next? I saw a guy added something to the archives about metal rods being used to harness lightning during storms. That yeah, reminded me of a cousin of mine. Thought he could trap lightning if he covered himself in stormbird plates. Went up the tallest mountain in the claim to prove it. It ended like a lot of Osaram things do. With a spark and a boom. How are things going around here? Hey, you tell me. Varl's new girlfriend tried to kill me earlier. What did you do? I made one joke about how they, you know, eat grass a lot. How does anyone fight with nothing but tree leaves in their stomach anyway? From the looks of it, the Utaru. Yeah, well, I wasn't expecting it to be that fast. Just try not to get hurt. Are you playing that board game I keep seeing everywhere? Oh, you mean strike? Yeah, I'm just trying to you know, get some practice in. Helps take my mind off things. Yeah, it's a Tanakh game. I thought about playing Katalo, but what if he tries to kill me if I win? I think you're safe. Yeah, I don't know. Heard a lot of things about that tribe. Do I smell ale? Yeah, I brought some over from Chain Scrape. Hey, with everything that's been going on, I thought we could all use a drink. Besides, there is nothing that brings people together like a good brew. That's what my sister always said, anyways. Hey, you're more than welcome to have some. Maybe another time. So, Talana came by the base? Yeah, more like rushed through. I was hoping she'd stay for a drink at least. Only Karja I've ever met who's any fun. But it seemed like she had more pressing matters to attend to. I should get going. Back to reading, I guess. Do be careful out there.
All right, I'm done with them for right now. Where is uh? I forgot what Catalo is. This is our room. I think this is no. This is no. This ain't our room. Is this our room? Nah, nah. That's not our room. That's for all. This is our room. <laughs> Looks like I was able to unlock that door. What door are you talking about? There's a lot of equipment in here. Gaia, what was all this for? This room was designed for management of the facility's vast sea banks. From here, Control center operatives would have monitored new crop rotations into the automated farmlands, now known as Plainsong. I see. According to this console, there are still thousands of plant samples stored deep below the facility. I could ask Gaia about them the next time I talk to her. Okay, we'll do that later. Oh, you can just press it down. I didn't know that about that. Yes. Looks like some of the holograms are working now. I have repurposed the displays to track Regala's activity in the region. A useful war map. Mind if we have a word? Of course not. You said you were training with the focus? That's right. I've been... Watching holograms of your first fight with the Zenith Spectres. They are faster and more agile than any machines I've faced before. How many do the Zeniths have? I'm not sure. Probably a lot. I would not wish to face them en masse. I'm with you there. Let's try. I I'll come back for these two. What is this? Yeah, I don't really care about them. Like, uh, uh, yeah. I should get going. I'll come back if for I that. I can help in some way. Say the word. I will. Thank you. But so you can't activate the mission. I guess because I, I, I swear she said he, he had a way around something. He had a way around something, but what? Coordinates that Gaia gave me for Demeter are close. Okay. They're close. He just dive down there, actually. Oh crap. What happened here? This ain't good. Someone managed to take out an entire squad. Sure. I'm not alone out here. There's lights in that ruin. I better keep my guard up. Like we're not going to be friends. I need to get past these hostels and into the ruins. Ooh, they're going to take a little bit. What? I hit you. Yeah, I get. All right, bro. Since the game said I didn't hit you. I'm gonna hit you like that. 
Yo, that dude just spawned. Didn't he just spawn? Ah, uh, fuck us. I'm going to get, I'm getting close and personal. Unless I can't, because there's stuff right there. you Take her out. Take that asset For the ancestor. Take it boys And why are they out for blood I better get to Demeter fast in case there's more of them Queen Gaia, Marine. should be somewhere in these ruins. None of these people are Marines, bro. Marines would have at least tried to talk to you first when you tried to give up. Unless they're insane. I'd have been like, put your weapon down or something, something like that. There's a lot of like uh, barrels in here. Let's go over here. Greenhouse. Looks like some sort of old office complex. I want to know if there's more people. Doesn't look like it. But that don't mean there ain't more people. Ferrell Automated Solutions Industry Leading Biotech Research Facility. Agritech. Environmental Remediation. Organic Waste Management. Whatever your company needs, in the greenhouse that will help solve your problems. Ferrell Research Facility. Hmm. Let's see. Like some of this. When can we get the tool for this? Demeter should be right beyond that door. But those vines are blocking the way. Unless I can cut through them, I'm gonna need to find another way in. They take their time when they're giving you tools, man. Nothing else in here? Okay. Over here, there we go. A room with no way out. <sighs> Great. At least there's a console. Good. Yeah, legendary here. A log. Just got off the line with US Robot Command. 
running out. I didn't have the heart to tell Harris that our cure might be worse than the disease. Even if adamantine wreath works, we still have to prove we can curtail the trailing plants efficiently. But Cobble's team is working on it over at Test Station Ivy. He'll come through. He has to. Adamantine wreath. Another secret project. Well, they made the metal flowers here and the vines, so... Maybe I can find a way to destroy them. If I can find Test Station Ivy. How do I get out of here? They want me dead. I'd better be careful. Maybe I should have scanned them from on top, but it's all good. Okay. I could take those soldiers out quietly. There's a barbarian in the compound. She got past the lookouts. Find her, kill her, and bring her head to the lieutenant. Understood. This diplomacy is off the table. Nah, nah, nah. Hell no. Nah. Father killer. Nah, fuck all that. I'm gonna kill you. Not one more step, barbarian. I'll destroy her. I like to see you try, boy. Yeah, double kill. I'm wearing you down. Help us off straight in the head. That didn't even hit me, but hey. Ah, oh, it's you that's shooting me. And now I'm finna mess you up. I hate when you you see that, and then I I release nothing happens. I'm gonna go rage mode. I'm gonna just come over here and wait till it run out, and you're doing you're done. Things they give the enemies in this game. Hit her! Got you. Not one more step, barbarian. What the? F I dare you to survive. I was gonna light you up. I really wish those people would have talked to me instead of trying to kill me. Oh, now I need to find a way out of this courtyard. Nah, they wanted to die, it's all good. You don't disrespect Aloy like that. I'll kill you.
Berserker arrow hunter arrows. I submit. Do as you will. I didn't want to fight your friends out there. They attacked me. If by death alone, I can atone our trespass. Look, I'm not gonna kill you, okay? I just want to figure out what's going on. Where did you get that focus? Uh, I'm of the chosen people. The Quen. The ancestors left the power of the focus to us alone, the eye that reveals the legacy. The legacy, huh? The legacy? Uh, the truth. Now, it is in the darkness and the lost places, among the ancient ashes and the bones of the before that it lies waiting. You know, as a diviner, it is my task to seek it out for the good of my people. You're looking for data. Maybe we can help each other. What's your name? Alpha, second diviner of the Eastern Expedition. I'm Aloy. Why don't we start again? I've never heard of the Quen. Our lands lie across the Great Ocean. We haven't been here before. So why come now? Our homeland has been ravaged by freakish weather. Terrible storms and blistering droughts. The crops are failing. The people are starving. When we looked for answers, it was proposed that if we had the courage to cross the ocean to Legacy's landfall, then we might earn the knowledge we need to save our people. But so far, that knowledge has eluded us. So, your people call this place Legacy's Landfall? No. Uh, landfall is where we arrived. To the west, in the shadows of the sunken city by the Broken Bridge. You mean San Francisco? Yes. You're well versed in the Legacy. It was a place of great importance to our ancestors. We had hoped to learn their secrets there, but so far that door remains closed. Even so, the data we discovered there has led us to this place. It might be our last chance. To find something that can save your crops and your people. Yes. If the ancestors will be generous to us once more. Why do they attack me, though? Those soldiers. They opened fire on me without warning. Why? Uh, it is the duty of the Quen to seek out the legacy and defend it from the ignorant and envious. Not that you seem ignorant. But back home, other tribes only mean us harm, and we were told the same was true here. Does that come from your legacy? The legacy is truth. But we have been known to misinterpret it. I hope time and the wisdom of our ancestors will guide us down the correct path. Yeah. I hope so, too. I'm looking for a place in this facility called Test Station Ivy. Have you found any data that mentions it? No. Uh, but I did find something that looks like a map. Uh, but it was unreadable. Lost. Maybe I can make some sense of it. Uh, there. There's a lot of files here. <sighs> I've been through all of them. Look in the GH facility section. Like I said, a lost file. You can't see the map? It's okay. It looks like your focus is an early model. The operating system won't be able to read any files created after the mid-2050s. But I could share them with you. Share them? <gasps> oh, 
You can see what is lost and forbidden. Not lost, not forbidden, just a newer format. There, that's where I need to go. Oh, but you can't get there. We've been here for a week trying to get deeper into the complex. The way has been blocked by rubble. What about this tunnel? It looks like it unlocks from here. No. I thought these might be some kind of access controls, but I couldn't read enough data to make them work. Let's try with my focus, okay? I believe these consoles were meant to be operated in unison, but I'm not sure. Okay, here we go. Following your lead. The ancestors have shown us the way. Come on, let's go. You want me to come with you? It took both of us to open up that tunnel, didn't it? Cool. Got a companion for right now. Keep going, you like where you stop. Oh, this place is a maze. According to the map, there should be another exit further in. Just stay close. Lead the way. Yeah, I don't care about that. If it ain't purple or gold, I don't care. I can't believe you actually got us in. I was dreading having to stay here any longer with those soldiers. The way they slaughtered the barbarians that approached the site. It was like they enjoyed it. Most of my people aren't like that, I promise. You say so. I believe you. If you're friendly, of course. Of course, there gotta be some other people that's friendly, just like you. Okay, unless you got most soldiers around. I cannot scan that. Okay. There has to be a way out of here. Through here. Oh, that's the tracker. Let me just put in a regular arrow. Or the advanced regular arrow. Okay, so you should go to the right. According to the map, the exit should be this way. Water dripping. There's uh, there's oh, there's something gold here. Take it. Hmm. Oh, must have taken a wrong turn. That's okay. I just wanted to see what was over there. It had to be something over there. I'll be glad to get back above ground. Yeah, it feels like a turn down here. Hopefully there's nothing to fight down here, because I don't think she could fight. We got a ladder. A good ladder. Ooh, that's new. They fly to and from the complex several times a day. Only the ancestors know why. Well, the ancestors are dead, Elva. Of course. How else could they be ancestors?
Looks like we have more pressing concerns. Follow my lead. All right. I saw something in the cutscene that I wanted to get. <laughs> it's a medicine. That's crazy. It gave me 12. Long leg. Machines. We can fight them. Or try to sneak past. Your call. Shotgun was not much use against that. Oh, I thought I was crouched. My bad. Just walked right in front of that machine. Bro, right, don't come over here. I'll hack you. <laughs> you don't want to get hacked because then you go against your friends. Knowledge for you can help me find those rations Runda needs. Override a Brizzleback. Oh, that's a contract. <sighs> I hate that you can't switch it exactly. How, um, what the? What does defensive mean exactly? It's almost over, it's cool. I wanted to fight anyways. What just happened? You wanna play? Me too. Dude, I cannot. I can't move. That's so weird. The Berserker Dart is it, cool, but it don't work. Like, it, it attacked me only. No, you don't. You don't need my help. You good. Glad that don't do damage. Yeah, you probably would never ever see anybody fight like I do.
Okay, wing burner. That's cool. I'm taking everything. Give me everything you got. Vent. I think I can pull it open. Got it. I'm right behind you. The entrance to the complex. Looks like it's locked off. I haven't had to shoot one of those in a long time. Bro, she just walked off. She be doing some things out here. Okay. station there's consoles up here too i know where to get to them you stay put i'll see what i can find gonna need a data key for this lock i think i can move these things what is these things she speak of I know I could get through there. Climb up. Okay. It's not an ideal spot for that, but okay. to uh, uh, blow up a wall I'll uh, try what are those things along the walls oh there's something right there I know if you could touch those or not Okay. This one actually is moved. Those rails on the floor lead into the walls. There we go. Huh. There's some space back there. This should help. I'm guessing that's the only one that moves. Oh no, this one moves too. Supplies. This one's blocked off. Okay, all the other ones are not accessible. Let's get this. Yeah, if you can hop on top of it, I can get you to those consoles. Exactly. Okay. Hold on. That's good. Jumping over. <sighs> Made it. 
I'm at the console. Wait! There's data here. A, a lot. But it's blocked. Something's restricting access. If I can't get past it, my mission here is doomed. Alva, I'll help. If I can, okay? But first we have to get out of here. Right. We need to open the hatch. Okay, let's see... Okay. I'm unlocking a storage unit. There should be a power cell inside. Then you need to find a way into the generator. I found the energy cell. Oh. Okay, I'm on it. I should have waited. Next time I'll wait before I'll go and just move stuff. <laughs> I didn't see that come. I didn't know it was on the side. I was like, where is this one? Storage unit has to be here somewhere. Okay. That brought power back to the doors. You can reach me now. On my way. Alright. Just making sure something. Operate both consoles simultaneously to open the hatch. I'll get to the other console. You stay here. Ready when you are. Okay, you ready? On two. One, two. Commencing adamantine reef vulnerability test scenario 12C15. Okay, that's where we need to go. Magnetic field engaged. Initiating biomass conversion process. What? No, 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 no. How do I shut this thing off? Let's meet below. I'm gonna share a file with you, okay? Test log. Um, uh, I think it's Tuesday. The second. Biomass conversion here. Infinite food for infinite machines. And now we're racing against time to find something to give them indigestion. Oh, well, it works. War machines won't be able to eat the reeds. But can we deploy them in time? God, I hope so. I don't understand. Your ancestors? They were wiped out. Your legacy didn't tell you that? The time of ashes. But most of the data about that is lost or forbidden. Well, they created machines that consumed all life. You just saw how. It's a miracle anything survived. I don't want to know this. This is not why I'm here. 
I need the wisdom of my ancestors to help save my people, not forbidden knowledge of their sins. I need to find something that helps, something to bring back. The overseers will punish me, or even worse, people will die. Do you understand? My family, my sister. I left her when she was 14. Already you could see her bones. They will starve. Alva. Alva. I get it. I do. It's hard to explain, but you and I are working toward the same goal. And if I succeed, your people won't need any data. Things will just... They will get better. But even if I believe you, my people won't. I need to bring something back. Okay. Then we'll go to Test Station Ivy. And if I can find a way to kill those vines, then I will have access to the data core. What I need is in there. I'm pretty sure that if I take it, it will unblock access to all the data that this place has. And that will give you something to bring home. I'm not sure I understand. But... Every secret makes its own maze. A diviner must persevere. Go on. I'll follow. We need to keep moving. Test Station Ivy can't be far off. Mm -hmm.